I've been coming here with my family for, oh goodness knows how long. For Kelly McClary, it's not the end of summer without a trip to Cascade Locks. That right here. And ice cream. This is mine. From East Wind Drive-In. So this is a medium. Don't order a large or you're going to be eating it all day. This Labor Day outing feels carefree. But exactly two years ago, as plumes of smoke rose up over the gorge, something very heavy was on the horizon. I'm thinking, you know, this is going to change the face of the gorge forever. It was the Eagle Creek Fire, started by a firework dropped near the tinder dry Eagle Creek trailhead. The fire burned through 48,000 acres and cost more than $20 million to fight. The state also closed I-84 East between Troutdale and Hood River for three weeks. That impacted towns like Cascade Locks and businesses like this ice cream stand. We were at Eagle Creek when the fire started. Steve Freeman had spent the day there fishing. Two years on the day. He left right before the fire exploded. My hope is uh, all the trails and everything open up and we don't have rocks falling and, you know, my wife and I would really like to do a lot of the, you know, the trails again. I'm so excited. Here. On Sunday, the Forest Service reopened Waclella Falls Trail. After two years, they feel hikers are safe from rock and landslide danger. It's still gorgeous. <laughs> it's still beautiful. We went down yeah. and checked out the creek and we saw some of the salmon swimming upstream, which was awesome. Interesting to see how it's changed after, you know, post fire. So I'm eager to get back out there. Most of the two and a half mile hike is open, but fire damage is keeping the upper section closed for now. Two years later, the Eagle Creek Trail is still closed. But maybe not for long. Forest officials say depending on the weather and safety assessments, they could reopen the trail as soon as this fall or as late as next summer. We were saying that on the way here about all the woods and how everything's greening up and, you know, everything's coming back. It'll take time. For now, there's ice cream. It's really good to see the place booming. I mean, seeing all the people here just makes me really happy. In Cascade Locks, Catherine Cook, KGW News.